Hi dudes, let's do some basic weapon modifications to make our melee ability more exciting. We're going to go to last weapon highlighted. Highlight the weapon we want to change. If you're low level and you can't wield something, go here. Stat requirements, I've already changed mine. Here's what we really want physical damage add to it as you can see I didn't go too crazy with it stamina not quite double but it's close to doubled that's uh, stamina damage how much stamina they lose on attack very useful effect on hit if you watch the spell basic spell hacking video you know ah geez you know how to mess with these to apply unique effects to the person that you hit when you hit them effect on self just means when you equip the weapon so these three will activate when you actually equip or re-equip the weapon right now I just have some random crap letting watchdogs in that's a quick and easy way to apply some effects to yourself but anyway we're not done. We want to increase the range of our weapon. Going to collapse this, collapse this, check this, memory view, control G, type attack. Every conceivable attack is its own thing, as you're going to see in the box to the right. So we want to sprint attack, we want to roll attack, we want a one hand, two hand, I've not done everything but do everything you want to change, copy this, put it in attack helper, and this first hit radius value is what we want to mess with. Usually it's well under 1. I've got mine set to 2.5, which they just think is lag, usually. Special effect IDs, if you want some effects applying just on your strong attack or your weapon art or whatever, you can add effects here. And most of this stuff is not worth messing with, usually. Knockback distance is very funny offline. You can knock back people that you hit like as far as you want, but it's useless online. They can't see it. I already have my weapon enhanced, so let's just try it out. And on those effect on self things, you can, of course, put any weapon buff you want, including weapon buffs that usually you can't use on boss weapons. So, for example, if I want Storm Ruler on this sword, Yeah, I was excited about Storm Ruler when I found it. And that's kind of annoying. So if you look closely, you'll see the added range. Or not. He mad. I'll demonstrate on world enemies.
Obviously, I've not gone overboard here, but it's just enough to throw people off on their timing. And that's it. That's the quick and easy basic weapon hacking. And I've got another guy here. Come to Uncle Pegwad. <laughs> yeah, that was a little, uh... That actually hit him, but he had, uh, iframes on. I mean, just like natural iframes. From rolling and stuff. Oh jeez. This looks like a good time for my hunter charms. I think he has my modded spell on. Since I'm the host, he's getting my extra damage. Oops. Talk about backfiring. These guys deserve it. I'll give it to them. He's probably like, since when was I this powerful? Okay, dudes, basic, uh, basic weapon hacking. And as always, praise the pig. That's my catchphrase. <laughs>